I've finally made a video after one whole year. Hey yo, what the fuck? Anyways, I come out of video making hiatus cause I got sponsored. Kinda? I got to play the early demo release of Set Up, a culinary adventure featuring these characters that I wanna say are inspired by Splatoon. I mean, look at this dude. You can't tell me that doesn't look like the green inkling from Smash. How'd I get this early access game, you ask? No one cares, you twat. My Riz. So, Sadap's a co-op cooking combat adventure that combines the chaos of a collaborative kitchen and the wonders of adventuring into an unexplored world. Embark on an exciting don't culinary don't journey. I don't care! <laughs> And it was developed by the folks over at Kopi Forge. I hope they make some good kopi. I like my gatai by the way. On another note, I am very much what Asians like to call banana. Meaning I look Chinese but can't speak it very well or at all. Like if I go to a coffee shop, I usually just run straight for the Japanese or Western food kind of banana. So sorry in advance if I mispronounce any words. You start by playing between two characters named Gon, the hunter, and Som, the uh, cooker? Huh? This lady over here is named Merapi and is basically your tutorial narrator and tells you what to do. Then you just get cooking. First up is pineapple fried rice. Gotta take some rice from the rice cooker, kill some chickens for their meat, and kill this turtle with a pineapple growing on its back. Okay. I wonder how the anatomy works for that thing. Like, does the pineapple feed the turtle? Or the other way? Moving on. There's a couple of actions you gotta do to prep some ingredients like chopping before throwing them in the wok to cook. Once that's done, you send it to the front. Simple enough. Rinse and repeat, and that's the first level done. You go back to camp. Please god, I don't wanna go back to camp anymore, I just wad eat. And you can talk to what will eventually be the shop guy. Can't do anything with him yet, so we move on to level 2. Ew. There. I hate tea. Coffee's better. Basically, you're introduced to a new dish every level and you keep making them according to what shows up in the top left of the screen. The process repeats, and I 3 star almost every level on my first try. Don't worry, I go back to get the 3 star. I die once. I, I'm dead. I just died. And then we come out on this level with a different label from the rest. This time you're making bubble tea. Ooh. And I hope that your bubble tea drinkers don't actually drink some of the flavors here. Like, who the fuck drinks sambal mixed with your tea? Or is this some kind of Chinese medicine mix? That level finishes and I get hit with a notice saying, It's over. You can't play the game anymore. Go to sleep. Blue balling me. When I just got all warmed up. And uh, yeah. That's it. That's the end of the gameplay. So, actually, I want to use a different word. Hold on. Hmm. Dance. Let's end with some thoughts I have after playing the demo. Is there going to be a difficulty setting? I consider myself an above average player. So I think it was a tad bit challenging already. Kind of worried for the more casual players on their end. I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like the controller controls are a little bit wonky. Like the inputs for menus don't respond sometimes. I think I want a kind of surprise boss type enemy to show up at random in later games. Like it'll impede progress and we gotta kill it to move on kind of enemy. Cause right now the gameplay is only making dishes in time and I like some mix ups here and there. Then again, these are just some things that I think could make the game better. Just take it with a grain of salt. Also, this isn't the dev's fault, but <laughs> out of all the food showed off in the demo, I actually don't eat any of them. Back on topic, setup's gonna come out soon? Oh, never mind. It's gonna be announced at this online showcase on the 21st of November. I have no idea what this is. <clears throat> Welp, wishlist the game on Steam for when it comes out.
On the other hand, you can catch me playing it live this Saturday on the 16th, where I'm gonna try and speedrun the game and claim first place. Cause, you know, it's a demo. No one's played it yet. Oh yeah, don't forget, subscribe. Cause, you know, big number make brain go boom. King crazy! Hey, you made it to the end of the video. Remember, like and subscribe. And since you're already here, why not watch another?